like this bit and subscribe to the channel your boy's trying to hit 20 thousand subscribers let me repeat that 20 thousand subscribers by the end of this year and if i don't have 20 thousand subscribers by the end of this year which is december 31st then a snake is gonna spawn under your bed at night and it eats you <laughs> so uh yeah if you don't want to get your feet took by rochimaru i suggest you subscribe to the homie but anyways hopefully y'all enjoy the rest of this video Hey, what is up guys? It's your boy Terra. We are back with another video. So today we are playing a game I haven't played in a minute. We're playing AX2. So they released a new update with a couple um, uh, Demon Slayer characters. So today what I'm going to be doing is showcasing the homie Tanjiro. So first I'm going to go in the training room. And then since we can't do the awakening in the training room, we're going to go in a match. And then actually see what his awakening looks like in there. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Alright, so Tanjiro's first move, or actually let me go through all the moves. So he has first form water surface slash, third form flowing dance, eight form waterfall bastion, and then the last move he has is dance of the fire god. Now, uh, first form water surface slash is basically really just like a little dash slice, like you click it, you dash slice, you click it, you dash slice. It's, it doesn't have a long um, cooldown either, so you can pr pretty much uh, use it for mobility or like you can't really spam per se, but close, some, something close to that. Uh, it doesn't take a lot of stamina either, so that's very good. The second move is third form flowing dance. Now this move is a teleport move. Does 20 damage. Like like I said, we can't really check the awakening in this uh, the training room, but we're gonna have to see what it looks like when we get into the actual match. But it, it takes quite a bit of stamina, a normal amount for a move, a good move, and a teleport move at that. And then the last move we have for the base form Tanjiro is 8 form Waterfall Bastion. Now, this is like a bunch of water pillars. You click it, you just spawn a bunch of water pillars. I mean, I guess that's kind of cool. You feel me? Like, you got a bunch of people around you trying to team you. You pop this joint. You pop it a couple times, actually, because it doesn't take that much stamina either. You know what I'm saying? You pop that joint. You, uh, you know what I'm saying? Hit some water surface slashes and all that stuff. Finish with a flowing dance. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah. Anyway, since we've done that, let's go into the actual uh, matches now. Alright, so for this clip, I didn't really get to use the Awakening that long, but near the end, I actually got to use it for uh, quite a while. Um, the moves are Flash Dance, so what this does, it's literally like a quick teleport slash, you click it, you teleport slash, you click it, you teleport slash, and the cooldown is not even that long either, so you can pretty much use this a quite amount of time, so a good amount of time. The second one is See Through the World. I'm pretty sure it's a counter, but when I used it, the dude didn't hit me, so I couldn't really pop it off. And then dance is the fire slash so it's only the first like a one little fire slash but it does a good amount of damage so what i was doing uh in other clips that i'm gonna show you guys is i did flash dance and then use the normal uh, fire dance and then that bro that was doing some damage because the fire dance gives you a speed boost as well so you just pop the flash dance to get close to him he tries running away you pop the fire dance and uh yeah so uh, i'm gonna just let the rest of the clip play
all right guys it's gonna be the end of the video hopefully y'all enjoyed make sure to sub trying to hit that 20k like if you're new and i'll catch you on the next one peace